You see the bunny? Oh, there's Bonnie Bunny. <gasps> yep, just look. Good morning. It is 7.24 and I'm on the road. I like this getting out and up and out before 8 a.m. Oh, um, I'm either driving an hour and a half or I'm driving about five and a half hours. So, wanted to get on the road early so I can make that determination. I need to make a call just to verify uh, if I decide to go the five and a half hour that that park is actually open. Yeah, I just Tomorrow, heard on the radio. Temperatures drop almost 15 degrees, sunny and a high of 93, helped on by more. <laughs> 93 tomorrow, but today, 107. So, probably going to drive that uh, five and a half, six hours today, get in some cooler temperatures because I'm only going an hour and a half away or hour and 15 minutes. So it's still going to probably be close to three digit. They haven't opened the gate here yet. So that means I have to open it to let me out. <laughs> I guess they don't open until eight. Coast job, you know, I've had electricity for what two and a half months, and I visited a couple of other Texas state parks. Well, I've left Texas, and just like that, now I'm boondocking. Wasn't sure if I would um, be plugged in to electricity or not. Um, once I uh, arrived at my location and I do not so I mean the which is fine so I guess the point of this video is to make sure that you always are ready to boondock um, I pulled out one thing I didn't get ready prior to was my Lucy lights so I'm doing that right now got my Lucy lights they've probably been out for about three hours now so they're probably charged and my other little um, I use this in the desert to put under my truck it is solar and motion getting all my items that I use when I boondock I'm got those out and checked them which I should have done while I had power but I'd already got my jackery out it's 99% so we're good there uh, I have several of these to charge my cell phone if need be. It's at 100%, so we're good there. It's boondocking for the next several days, if not more. But I know probably three at this location, so um, it's good to go. Another thing to check on is the weather, because in the shade right now, it's not bad. It's about 80 degrees but in the sun it's warm but the breeze feels awesome and probably give it another hour hour and a half and the camper will be just fine it's supposed to be in the high 
high 40s tonight, so I just left, well, you saw in that video previously that it's supposed to be 104, where I planned on staying tonight, and so get up early, hit the road, and if you need to, you can continue on further to your next destination. And I'm happy I did because this is very, very nice. So, Sammy, we've gone from 104 degree temperature to 50. Yeah. Do you think you're going to get a bite of this? No. I don't think so either. So, it's late morning. We're still in bed. <laughs> it's cold. Got my wool socks on. And eating breakfast, eating oatmeal. Oatmeal and pumpkin seeds and that freeze dried apricot. Apricot? Peaches. Apricot, I think. Once I dumped it in the sack, who knows? Alright. Oh, no. Don't you knock this out of my hand. Sweet girl. She says, I want to bite mama. Oh, I wish you could see her face. <laughs> no, you can't have any babies. No, you can't. No, you can't. It's getting cold. I gotta eat. <laughs> Thank you.